Hello, it's Mella, and today's video is going to be episode 5 of my survival Minecraft series, because nobody asked for it, but I enjoy making them anyway, so hope you all enjoy watching, and let's just get into it. So the first thing that I basically did was go harvest my food and stuff, but I realized I didn't have a hoe, so that was kind of annoying. Had to go grab that and also, you know, put some food to smelt because I need food, you know? That's that's just one of those things that you, you gotta have. And then I decided, you know what, let's be a little adventurous, a little spontaneous. So I put away anything that is kind of important. Uh, then I realized it was getting kind of late, so I went to sleep and I woke up with that. Uh, I woke up in the morning with the idea, I'm gonna go down into that cave and kill some mobs, right? Well, you see, if I don't know if you saw, but that uh, block of grass at the top there, yeah, that means there's an enderman because they can pick those up and move them. So, yeah. Once I got in here, I realized it is big. There are a lot of caves intersecting here, as you can see. There are definitely a lot of mobs down there, and I decided, you know, I'm just gonna leave it be. I lit up part of it. I don't really have any more torches anyway. I just moved that piece of dirt because it was scaring me to be honest. And I ran all the way back home. And yeah, I collected my food, got my stuff back, and and we're good. We're good for the um, exploration of today. That sentence made no sense, but yeah, I'm good with exploring for today. Then I decided, let's get us some animals. So I decided to start making some fences. I try to conserve my wood as much as possible. So it was kind of a little bit difficult. Then I decided to chop this tree down because it was kind of in my way. Like, I can't really get to my house from there. I have to kind of go around it. Then I saw, ooh, there's some sheep right here. Perfect. Then I realized I don't have enough fences. So I had to make them a pit. Now, if y'all know, uh, it's sheep are annoying. <laughs> it, it's just, it didn't fit in the hole. So I had to make it bigger. I just, I had to push it in. Then I realized I don't have any wheat. I accidentally fed it to the other one, so I had to get some wheat. I also replanted it. Then I went and got the sheep back. Then I had to ever so carefully push it in whole, which, yeah, I know it's not the most humane thing, but it, it works for now, okay? Don't, don't judge me. So then I just kind of looked at my chest. I was like, what do I do now? I decided to plant the other seeds that I had. Also, I need to expand my house. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm going to work on that. It's going to happen soon. Hopefully the next episode, which probably will be in like a month. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm very lazy. Anyway, ran back to my house, put my sapling away, and just kind of looked at how ugly my chest was, and organized some stuff, got some flowers, put the flowers outside for some reason, because I don't know, I felt like decorating, I guess. I don't really know what, what the point of that was for. Anyway, here I just decided, you know what, let's make us some bricks. I didn't know what I was going to use them for, but I got them anyway. Yes, and now I'm organizing my chest again, because I try to be organized. I really, really do. I don't know why, but I always end up just dumping stuff in my chest. Like, it's, it's kind of a problem that I have. I don't know why. I'm usually such an organized person, and then when it comes to my chest, it's just never organized. Never. I really... I really don't know why. If anyone can explain to me why that is, just tell me, please. I need communication. I'm very lonely. Anyway, here I decide, okay, let's just wait for nighttime, put uh, my bricks in my inventory, and make some flower pots, because I love flowers. They look really cute in a Minecraft house. They're great decoration. Are there better uses for those bricks? Definitely. Do I know what they are? No. Am I going to, you know, use them? No. And yeah, it gave me an achievement, so look at that. That's that's great. I'm such a gamer. I made a flower pot. Wow, what a flex, am I right? I don't I don't know what I'm doing. Anyway. So it was raining. Very annoying. And it wasn't a thunderstorm, so I couldn't sleep through it, so I just kinda had to chill in my house. Uh I decided let's do some more decoration. I also wanted to put my flower pot somewhere. So I put up a little fence. That's not a fence, that is a shelf can't remember words and I collected one of my flowers from outside to put inside of it and look how cute that looks that's so cute it 
if only I weren't going to tear down half my house to make it bigger in, like, not very long. Anyway, it's fine. It's fine. It's all good, you know? It's all good. Anyway, here I decided I was kind of running out of things to do, so I just kind of grabbed some stuff. Put some other stuff there. I was like, oh, what if I smelt some stuff to see what it smelts into? I said I shouldn't do that. That's not really a good idea. I crafted some slabs. I don't really remember what my idea was for those. I'm not entirely sure what I was going to do with them. I turned the volume up. Don't know why. Turned it down. I still don't know why. <laughs> I think I was just looking for things to do. Put my fences up. I only had four, so it kind of... Er, no, I only had six, so it was kind of worthless. There were also a bunch of drowns, and they can, like, you know, attack you when it's raining. So I got kind of scared. He was, like, right outside my house. He didn't look like he wanted to attack me, but, like, also didn't want to jinx it, you know, by being like, oh, he looks he looks passive, and then going outside and he attacks me and kills me. Because, you know, that that's just the kind of person that I am. I don't really like to to um mess with things. Anyway, I woke up, stopped raining. Lovely. And I realized, yep, there are definitely going to be mobs. And spotted this drowned, decided to go kill it. This scared me so badly. I think I had a heart attack when that baby zombie ran up to me. It was on fire, and you guys, had, you had to see how fast that was, okay? Look, I literally just kind of sat here contemplating it for a couple minutes. It was just, goodness, it was so bad. It scared me so badly. It just, it, it was traumatizing, okay? It was very scary, definitely. Also, while I was ranting out with the baby zombie, I did not notice that I did in fact kill a skeleton, meaning I have bones now. I have bones. Like, that's so good. I can get myself a dog. And y'all know, dogs are really nice, you know, because they're dogs, and also because, um, they keep away mobs. And they're cute, so that's awful lovely. Also, it might just be on my screen that it's all messed up, but it appears to be that the um, video is shaking quite a lot. So I'm very sorry if it actually is like that, because <laughs> it's not lovely to look at. It's it's not even slightly nice to look at. It's really annoying, actually. I... Oh, wait. Anyway, here I am just kind of looking around, eating, you know. I wanted to work on getting my sheep and stuff, and planting some stuff, you know? Doing the things that you do in Minecraft. This sugarcane thing right in front of my house, I'm kind of hating. It's a little bit ugly, you know? Don't really love that. Also, I realized I somehow didn't actually plant my, my sugarcane. I don't know, it was weird. And here I am crafting some gates, and some more fences and stuff. And some more gates, and some more fences, because... You know, I need those, and this, oh goodness, this was very difficult, oh goodness, I don't even want to narrate this part, anyway, sheep are annoying, and if you're gonna get sheep, just leave them in a pit, okay, just leave them in a pit, okay, don't make them a pen, it's very annoying, it, it doesn't work, this pen that I made was way too small, I should have just gotten more fences and put it all the way around, <sighs> yeah. It's it's fine. It's it's going to be fine later in the video, kind of. Except that I hit this one and it wouldn't come in. It's, it's boy. It's fine. It's fine. Also I thought you could close gates while sneaking. You can't. Not even not even slightly. Anyway. Here I uh, fed them some wheat, so now I have a baby. That's great. And now we need to get rid of that pit. So I looked at it. I somehow thought I didn't have any dirt, so I went to get some. I had dirt in my inventory. Might have actually been in my hot bar. I can't really tell, but I, I got more dirt because, you know, the most useful resource in the game. Dirt. Not even grass because I don't have silk touch. Just, just dirt, you know. Anyway, here I decided, yes, actually, we should expand the uh, cheap enclosure thing. Fence. I don't know words. Anyway. Then I decided, okay, let's go get a dog. I looked around for a dog, found a dog, got my bones, and I tamed it. Very cute. Adorable, right? So great. I love dogs. Woohoo. Would I have preferred a cat? Yes, but I don't know where village is yet, so it, it's going to be a dog for now. I got one of these flowers, which I literally, when I got the dog, I was in a field of those flowers, but 
Don't, don't talk about it. I, I know I'm not smart. Don't, you don't need to rub it in. I'm talking to nobody. Anyway, here I got, you know, some stuff. I also realized this drowned was chasing my dog, which my dog literally did nothing. It was just like, tra la la through the water. Like, seriously, dog, you're the one that's supposed to be protecting me, not me protecting you. Like, what is this? Anyway, here I fed my dog some rotten flesh because they eat that for some reason. I'm not sure why, but you know what? He seemed to enjoy it, so uh, let's go, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> Here is where I had the most unintelligent idea of all time. I, you, can, you can see what I did. I moved the gate incorrectly and now the sheep were escaping. It's not great. The baby sheep almost escaped. I tried to get them back here. Then I put some dirt there for some reason. Then I was getting stuck and it was getting dark. I went in my house. Looked out my window, and in just perfect time to notice that my dog had killed one of my sheep. And then I left. Goodbye.